Good evening, everyone. Happy Wednesday. Happy Upper Zoom prayer gathering. How are you? How's everyone doing? Musta kamusta? It's 8.01, September 13. It's my dad's birthday today in heaven. And uh, good evening from Rachel. Good evening, everyone. Uh, praise report. Uh, from Rachel, bumubuti na po ang tiyan ni Jairus. Pray request, uh, time time request lang po na wag po lumaki yung gallbladder polyps ni Jairus. Okay, sige, pag-pray natin yan. And uh, alright, let's start. Good evening, good evening. Uh, let's start with uh, Tita Fe. Tita Fe, good evening. Good evening po, Pastor and everyone. Good evening po. Mm -hmm. um, I praise the Lord because He always provides for our needs. Um, he protects us from sickness. He makes us strong and gives us healthy bodies. He supplies our needs. He is great and He answers our prayers. Amen. Uh, I praise the Lord for our church and for our brothers and sisters in the Lord, we feel the love of, of one another. And that itself, I know, because of the love of God. I praise the Lord for that. And wala akong request tonight, uh, except that uh, God will always protect the church and all our families mm -hmm. from the uh, from temptations, from um, the uh, temptations of the enemy by the enemy, and uh, from accidents, from anything, Lord, that is that should not happen. Mm -hmm. We need God's protection for everyone. Yon po ang aking prayer request. Amen. Thank you, Tita. So. Welcome. Here from Joshua, listening lang po ulit. Nasa repair shop pa rin, tablet ko. Hindi ko po kasi nababayaran. Praise support po. Some my classmates gave me $10 so I can get ID school. So I'm able to get the top card unlimited for a year. Pray request po na sana may tirahan na sana po. Right. Thank you, Josh. Uh, we'll continue to pray for that. Okay. Uh... Let's hear it from Tita Josie. Good evening, Tita Josie. How are you? Pray request and pray support. Good evening po, Pastor. Good evening po, Pastor. Good evening po sa lahat. Uh, ang prayer request ko po ay uh, yung kagalingan ng mga... Ay, prayer request sa una. <laughs> prayer request. Ma... Nauna kong prayer request para okay, ay... Kagalingan po ng mga may karamdaman sila. Jairo, si si Aldrin, uh -huh. si yung anak ni Noel, si Jaja. Uh, Nathan, Nathan. Nathan, lahat po ng may mga karamdaman, kagalingan po na nagmumula sa ating Panginoon. Amen. Yung prayer request ko naman po ay ah uh, uh, praise report ko po pala, praise report. Eh, nagpapasalamat po uh, kami ang lahat at uh, tayong lahat pala dun sa nangyari sa ating uh, uh, noong Sunday po. Amen. Ay, bago po yung ating oras eh, mas marami pa po tayo. Masigabong palakpakan. <laughs> <laughs> o apo ay uh, sa susunod ng mga linggo, ganun din po tayo karaming lahat. Amen. Uh, lagi po tayong ganun. Amen. Yung po ang aking praise report at uh, kakatuwa po. At uh, naging maayos po ang lahat. Naging maayos po ang lahat. Mm -hmm. Alam nyo, nabanggit nyo yan, tita. Uh, mm -hmm. Magkausap kami kanina. I had a meeting with uh, District Superintendent uh, Mark Liman kanina and uh, natutuwa siya na nagulat din siya no? Kumbaga, na ganun yung turn out no and even yung aking personal coach no si yung dating DS ng Norcal si John mm -hmm. Kun sabi niya when you move the church schedule from 9 o'clock to the prime time 11 o'clock sabi niya 
mababawasan ka na ng tao. Sabi niya, you might cut it into half. Pero mm-hmm. you're moving from nine to two. Sabi niya, you're crazy. Sabi niya sa akin. <laughs> <laughs> Praise pero, the Lord. Oh, pero kita niyo naman po, mas mataas ka yung number natin nung Sunday kesa nung nine o'clock tayo. Opo. Oh, you know, Ang pakabuti so, ng ating Panginoon. That is good. Our, our, Amen. Our, our Amen. people Amen. are faithful to God. They are not faithful to church. They are not faithful to La Filnas. They are not faithful sa pastor. They are faithful to God. Diba? Amen. Anong oras, Amen. kahit sa ilalim ng puno ng mangga, tayo magpupuri. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Amen po. Amen, Amen po. Thank you, Salamat Dr. Josie. Po Uh, magandang gabi po sa lahat. Makikinig lang po. Salamat po. Tita Bing. Good evening, Tita Bing. Alright, uh, let's go now to the Dangawens. Kuya Mani and Ate Janet. Good evening po. Mag- Good evening. Magandang gabi po. Good evening. Ako ay nagpapasalamat po at ako ay nakasama na sa Project 2. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> so... Uh, Ayan, every Sunday na ako makaka-attend kasi alas dos na po tayo. Uh, Amen. Salamat din po doon sa prayer nung ako po ay may sipon at para masakit ang aking lalamunan. Salamat po sa inyong mga panalangin. God is our healer. Amen. Amen. All right, thank you uh, mga dangawens. Uh, meron tayo ditong uh, phone in. <laughs> Good PM, Pepot here. Good evening Tita Pepot, magandang gabi sa iyo. Okay, let's go now to Giselle. Giselle, good evening. Good evening po. Good evening. Um, praise report ko po na submit ko na po yung graduation application ko po and Amen. Napasa ko po yung first quiz of the semester ko po noong Tuesday. So, gagraduate ka pala? <laughs> sa, <laughs> sa May po. <laughs> yes, nako masaya yan. Madali tayong graduating. Amen. Amen. And prayer request lang po, um safety lang po sa pagdadrive po papuntang school. Yan lang po. Amen. Thank you, Giselle. Let's go now to Carl James. Good evening, Carl James. Good evening po sa inyong lahat. Good evening, good evening. Um, aking uh, praise report po is um, naayos na rin po yung uh, passenger side mirror po ng sasakyan namin. Um, kahit hindi mahirap po yung pagka-appointment uh, pero nagawa po, naayos po. And also yung um, gumaganda na po yung uh, pakiramdam po ng aking tita po. Uh, oh, Quest po is Elsa. yung apa si Tita Elsa po. Ah uh, bubuti na po yung bispo sa huling usap nila ni Papa. Um gumaganda na po yung pakiram yung ano po pakiramdam po ni Tita. So praise the Lord po. Mm-hmm. Um quest po is uh, and also po pala I pray support yung yun nga po na bagay pang Tita Josie yung successful launch po ng 2 PM. Prayer request po is um healing po sa lahat po ng may sakit. Ilan po. Amen. CJ, peram ng boss mo, ha? Sige po. Sa biyernes, para pwede tayong magkantahan. Sige po, dadaling ko po. Mag-bidjoke tayo, bidjoke. <laughs> Alright, thank you. Good evening. Uh, let's go now to Sister Rose. Pwede ka ba, Sister Rose? Magandang gabi po. Good evening. Okay, uh, ang prayer, uh, I mean, ang praise report ko po, uh, papasalamat po ako kay CJ. Shout out kay CJ. At uh, wala pong susundo kay Lauren, nag-aabirya po, pero uh, nag- natulungan po niya ako kanina. Oh, yun ang maganda sa, sa ano, no? church community. <laughs> Opo, yeah, dahil po lahat ng ano, talagang nagtutulungan po tayo para Amen. po tayong iisang pamilya. Amen. And then, uh, isa pa pong praise report ko po eh, yung patuloy na blessing po. Patuloy pong dumarating sa atin uh, pero yung prayer request ko naman po, yung pumpesya namin ngayon na hospice, uh, medyo hindi po maayos ang lagay. So kung sakasakali pong siya ay eh, mamamaalam, sana po ay eh, yung pong madali lang ang ano, wala pong pain. Uh, si Claire Steinberg po, yun lang po ang yeah. prayer request ko po. Mm-hmm. 
Salamat po. Thank you. Thank you, Sister uh, Rose. Good evening. Uh, let's go now to Tita Pepot. Good evening, Tita Peps. Hey, good evening, Pastor. Good evening po. Uh, yeah, praise support uh, protection po sa mga anak ko sa kanila pong dahil uh, Pray request ko po yung colonoscopy ko sa Friday maging negative result. Umaga Saka, po ba yan? Umaga po, Pastor. Ayan, para pwedeng kumain sa gabi. Uh, <laughs> so, bukas mag-start na ako ng, ng, ano, eh, ng fasting Pasting. instruction. Mm-hmm. At saka protection po kay Stephen kasi every week pala nagbabago schedule. So by next week, ang schedule niya is 3pm to 11. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Kaya nag-worry kami hipi, hipi, paano siya kung uwi. So yeah. protection na lang po sa kami. Kasi sa Glendale lang kanyang trabaho eh. Sinusundan ko nga yung kanyang mga post eh, natutuwa ako eh. Kasi mm-hmm. parang ang saya-saya niya sa bago niyang trabaho, binibidyo niya yung mga ginagawa niya sa target eh. Ang ganun. Kaya lang yung oras kasi pastor, one week hanggang 11 siya, kaya uh, okay, hindi ko namin na papano. Uh, part talaga uh, yan ng ano, ng... Uh, ng um, kapos, uh, sabi namin, sasama namin siya sa Friday sa, sa ano natin, sa oh, inyo. Siyempre. Eh, eh, kaso, eh, kaso pastor, meron pala silang Bible study every Friday sa Zoom. Ah, okay. Ay, ayaw niya. Oh. Okay, oh. thank God at na uh, inaalagaan siya ng church doon. Yun lang po. Amen. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. So, let's go now to uh, who else? Uh, Jai, Rus. Jai, are you available? Jai, good evening. Okay, baka hindi available si Jai. So let's go now to Pastor Bert. Pastor Bert, good evening. Hi. Hi po. Magandang gabi po. Good evening, good evening. Good evening po. Ano po yan? Praise, praise report. Yes, praise report. Praise report. Eh, hindi pa ako nag-gain ng, ano, ng weight <laughs> <laughs> bumababa siguro uh, kakain ako ng, ano, ng mga, mga mabigat <laughs> mm-hmm. uh, siguro po ang pre-support ko ay yung ano yung keywords eh, uh, answered prayer na po yung ano niya yung application niya praise God at uh, uh, hoping na makapag-search ng trabaho next month I don't know at uh, ganun din kay Sister LB yung mm-hmm. trabaho nila na minsan uh, yung mga schedule nila eh, ay iba-iba pero praise God uh, yung pag-iingat ng Panginoon sa kanila mm-hmm. kasi yung, yung driving medyo ano, minsan na uh, early morning then uh, yung pag nila gabing-gabi na minsan mm-hmm. uh, yun lang po yung mga pasalamat ko at uh, yung good health uh, sa family. Yan ang pasalamat. Praise report. Ay, uh, prayer request. Yung patuloy yung kay, ano po, kay Marie Pagio Valdez. Mm-hmm. Yung uh, ano po, uh, request niya about uh, filing yeah. and uh, yeah. uh, yung sa US uh, na nasa ano na raw po eh, yung mga papers niya. Mm-hmm. Inintay na lang ang response ng USCIS ata. Yun lang po. Thank you po. Thank you. Tsaka nursing application. All right. Thank you. Uh, good evening. Samsung SM A14 A, A14 a 5M. Good evening. Please identify yourself. Good evening po. Sino po si Samsung SM? <clears throat> Sino po? Gabriel. Hi, Gabriel. <laughs> <laughs> Ikaw pala yan, Briel. Palitan natin ang... Ayan, Briel. Oh, Briel, do you have a praise support and prayer request? No, po. Okay. So, 
Para si Clyde Bosses ni Clyde yun, di naman si Brie. Hindi, baka si Brie. Si Brie yun ba yun? Okay, uh, let's go now to Justin. Justin, take it away for our uh, uh, devotion. Alright, alright. Devotion. Okay. Sa mga co-host, pagka merong pumasok, Kindly uh, admit them. Thank you. So, welcome to Simbang Pinoy, the Upper Zoom Prayer Gathering, 8 p.m. every Wednesday. Don't forget to invite. Uh, we're done with prayer support and prayer request. So, tonight, tonight it's Justin's turn. Next week, it will be Kuya Mani. Ang ating Kuya Mani uh, adangawin, ang ating uh, facilitator sa ating uh, uh, devotion. So, welcome to Pagbubulay-Bulay sa Salita ng Diyos. Take it away, Justin. Uh, okay. Uh, the verse I picked was Romans 5.18-19. to 19. Uh, I'll just read it. Um, so then, as through one trespass, there is condemnation for everyone. So also through one righteous act, there is justification leading to life for everyone. For just as through one man's disobedience, the many were made. Um, the many were made uh, righteous. So, um, the topic I chose for tonight was about obedience. Uh, the Word of God promises that obedience uh, leads to blessings. Obedience um, to God's commands is one of the things that marks us as Christians. So, whenever we choose to disobey, we actually profane God's name since we bear his name. Uh, and not only that, disobedience has negative consequences since we would be going our own way instead of God's perfect way. Since we're short-sighted, we can't see. Um, we don't, we're not omnish. We're not uh, all knowing like God. We don't know the consequences of um, every decision. So we always have to rely on God's wisdom. Even though we know this, it's often hard to submit to God. Uh, even Paul, the apostle, he said, for I do not understand my own actions, for I do not do what I want, but I do the very thing I hate. But uh, thank, thankfully, Jesus serves as the model for perfect obedience and submission to the Father. My question for tonight is, uh, how is Jesus able to do this? How is he always able to obey his Father even to the point of his own crucifixion? And I guess another question uh, I could answer either one is, how can you better obey God? So, uh, I guess I'll go first. So, I think, uh, as the Word of God says, there's a constant battle between flesh and other, but they cannot be more at all to each other. So, our flesh, it wants to, uh, our, our flesh, if we follow it, that's, uh, self gratification, but following God's spirit, that's uh that leads to holiness and righteousness. So whichever one you will feed more, will be the stronger driving force in your life. So if you always satisfy the desires of the flesh, uh, the desires of the flesh will be even stronger. But feeding the God spirit will help you to obey God more. It's like um. 
practicing a skill or exercising a muscle, you just do it more. Uh, you feed God's spirit more by spending time with him in prayer and his word. And you'll get stronger spiritually. Uh, the other question is, uh, so there's two questions. You could answer either one. How is Jesus able to fully obey or how can you better obey God yourself? Thank you, Justine. All right, let's start with uh, Tita Josie. Good evening po, Tita Josie. Hello po, good evening po ulit. Mm -hmm. Ang tanong dito ni Jess, Jessie, paano matagumpay na sinunod ni Jesus ang Diyos Ama? Uh, alam naman natin yung sinunod niya ang kanyang Ama hanggang sa kamatayan upang tayong lahat ay ma maligtas. Doon po pumapasok yung John 3.16. Ayun nga po. Uh, malaking sakripisyo po yung ginawa ng ating Panginoon na uh, siya po ay pinarusahan na no? wala naman po siyang kama wala naman po siyang kasalanan hanggang ikamatay po niya ito. Yun po yung malaking pagsunod niya sa ating Panginoon para lahat po tayong mga makasalanan ay matubos sa lahat ng ating mga kasalanan. Yun po. Amen. Napakabuti ng ating Diyos. Amen. Thank you, Tita Josie. Uh, let's go now to Tita Fe. Tita Fe, good evening po. The question, how can we better obey God? And uh, I heard from Justin say that spending time in prayer before God and reading God's word will help us mightily in obeying the Lord. When we read the Bible and when we pray before the, before the Lord, um, it develops, it gives us knowledge of how great God is. And we learn from the word so many things about God, blessing everyone who obeys him. And things that God can do through the word we learn um, makes us overwhelmed with a joy in the Lord, having a lifestyle with God, and at the same time develops fear in us because through the word we learn the consequences that will follow sinful people so faith is built uh, reverence is developed and so with the fear and the reverence before god we always stand to obey the lord so pr again praying a relationship with jesus or with god almighty and being um spending time in reading God's word mightily helps us to obey him and revere him. Amen. Thank you. Thank you, Tita Fe. All right. Good evening, po. Good evening. Uh iPhone Lisa. Uh, kindly identify yourself. Sino po si iPhone Lisa? Good evening po. Pastor, kaibigan ko po yan. Katrabaho ko po. Gusto po ah, makinig. Ah, okay. Good evening. Pilipino po ba siya? Apa. Ah, okay, okay. Good evening po, Sister Lisa. Welcome po sa aming uh, prayer gathering every Wednesday. All right, Let's go now to... Uh, let's go now to... Uh, good evening, Sister Analu, uh, Brother Mark. Uh, listen po muna. Okay. So, good evening, good evening. Let's go to Kuya Mani and Ate Janet. Kuya Mani, Ate Janet, ito po ang ating patanungan. How was Jesus able to fully obey the Father? Jesus po, He's being filled with the Holy Spirit of believing in God. 
Sabi nga po ni Pastor Tanchi, Christian life is not difficult. It is impossible. It's only through by the power of the Holy Spirit that we believers be able to overcome. So si Jesus po, He is always filled with the Holy Spirit. Lamang po. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Sister Janet. Uh, Kuya Mani, anything to add? Happy paste. Happy paste. <laughs> All right. Good evening, Sister Jezel. Your turn. Jezel. Hello. Hello. Good evening. Uh, um usually po kasi we learn how to be obedient kasi nagiging disobedient tayo at times but for Jesus it's so clear that um his focus was obeying his father only to do what pleases God and not men pero yun po my answer would be Jesus um fully learned obedience through sufferings and temptations so during hard times um nagstand firm talaga siya and trust the father he was tempted by satan directly and he is tested throughout his ministry but um he says no to the passing pleasures of sin and says yes to his father and nakatingin lang siya direct nang diretso kay lord not minding the evil works and the worldly things around him and then um in small trials he trusted him So in his biggest trial, he surrendered to him, and his obedience was, for me, but was most clearly seen on the cross. In Lampo. Amen. Thank you, Jezel. All right. Uh, yeah, I I agree with you, know, Jezel. Yung yung magdating sinabi niya na yung true trials, no, and uh, struggles and everything in life. Kung baga yun yung ane, eh, yun yung parang fortifying, ah, uh, may assure. Uh, hindi yung puro masaya-masaya lang, happy-happy lang, alam niyo yun. Kung baga, doon lang natin sinusunod si Lord. Pero paano na, pag hindi masaya, pag uh, magulo ang buhay, di ba? We should still follow and obey Jesus. All right Good evening, Sister Rose. Your turn kung pwede ka. Good evening. Uh, ako po, uh, sa tingin ko po, uh, si Jesus po ay nag-obey po sa ating, uh, sa kanya pong ama. Dahil sa laki po ng kanyang pagmamahal po sa kanyang ama po. Ama po sa langit natin. Uh, ganun din po tayo sa ating mga anak minsan. Ang mga anak po natin nag-uubay uh, sa atin po dahil sa laki rin ng pagmamahal. At sa laki rin po ng pag-ibig sa atin ng Panginoong Heso Kristo po. And then ako naman po yung... Sa akin po para makapag-ubay po ako. Sa tingin ko po yung malaking factor po sa akin na... Pinipili ko rin po yung crowd ko. Mm-hmm. Dahil uh, may kasabihan po na, na sabihin mo sa akin kung sino ang iyong mga kaibigan at sasabihin ko kung sino ka. Mm-hmm. Uh, malaking bagay po yung naririnig ko po ang salita ng Diyos at mm-hmm. na-influensyahan din po ako ng mga nakakasama ko po sa araw-araw po. Yun lang po. Amen. I agree with that. First, the motivation is love. Second, sabi ni Sister Rose, Piliin mo kung sino kasama mo dahil uh, maapektuhan ka nila. Di ba? Uh, kumbaga, uh, malaki ang influence ng mga tao sa paligid natin. So, kailangan piliin natin para maanda ma- ma- tayo, magbago tayo sa Panginoon. Amen? So, good evening, Tita Peps. Your turn. Tita Pepot? Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, ako, Pastor, uh, ano ba tanong? Paano matagumpay na sinunod ni Jesus? Di ba, Pastor, tayo kung merong gusto ipagawa sa atin ng magulang natin at ayaw natin gawin, minsan hindi natin nagagawa. Pero si Jesus, dung, in, di ba kailangan sinabihan sa ni, ng, Father, ng Father God na kailangan mag-sacrifice siya para ma-redeem tayo. Mm-hmm. So, talagang sinunod niya pati to, to, to the point of being crucified on the cross kasi yun lang ang pwede makapag-save sa buong mundo. So hmm. by that by that uh, action, talagang matagumpay na sinunod niya. Sumunod lang siya sa gusto ng Ama para gawin niya para ma-save ang buong mundo. Yun lang po. Amen. Thank you. Thank you, Tita Pepot. 
All right, let's go now to Pastor Bert. Pastor Bert, good evening. Ay, magandang gabi po. Good evening, good evening. <laughs> Ang tanong ay paano, ano yan? Uh, paano, paano matagumpay na sinunod ni Jesus ang Diyos Ama? Well, uh, palagay ko po eh, uh, kagaya natin, no? uh, nagkataon-tao si Jesus at naranasan din niya yung nararanasan natin. It's very hard for him and yet, no? we know that he is 100% God and 100% man. So there's a struggle no if we will look at it in reality na kasi sinasabi ng iba he was able to obey the father because he is god actually that is half truth no mm -hmm. you must remember that he is also 100% human ang naging sekreto lang sa kanya yung let not my will be done but your will be done Kahit na alam niya na mahirap, pero alam niya na kailangan, no? O pang yun nga, na the, the mission is to, to redeem. Sabi nga sa Matthew 1.21, if I recall that, na sabi niya, Jesus came to save mankind or the sinners. So yun ang purpose niya. Focus siya doon, no? Kasi alam niya na Father loves so well, his creation, especially man who was created in his image. So yun po, siguro sa akin lang, kahit na iksiyan ko lang, siguro yung uh, not our will, no, but his will be done. Amen. Thank you po. Thank you, Pastor Bert. Carl James, good evening sa iyo, CJ. Good evening po. Uh, para sa akin po, um, um siguro i think na uh, i think uh, med, hindi ko pa no related po to sa nabasa ko po recently pero sabi po dun sa John 15:10 if you keep my commands you will remain in my love just as i have kept my father's commands and remain in his love mm -hmm. so i think um kaya po naging ay naging uh, ano si Jesus dahil sinunod niya yung um command god so um be tayo bilang Christians sig um I think para sa akin mas para para natin mas maobey si God is i-align natin yung align natin yung mga plano natin sa will ni God and um continuously have time uh, spend time with with God like having conversation like ha having conversation through prayer and um I I po I think if you share ko. Amen 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 Basahin ko lang ulit, no? sabi dito uh, sa, sa CSV, CSB version. So then, as through one trespass, there is condemnation for everyone. Ang tinutukoy dito si Adam. Alright? No? Sa, sa, sa Tagalog. Uh, at kung paano ang pagsuway ng isang tao ay nagdulot ng kaparusahan sa lahat. Um, it is pertaining to Adam. Okay? So also, through one righteous act, there is justification leading to life for everyone. Sa Tagalog, uh, ang matuwid na ginawa rin ng isang tao ay nagdudulot ng pagpapawalang sala at buhay sa lahat. So, this, obviously, this pertaining to Jesus. Di ba? So, sabi dito, for just as through one man's disobedience, the many were made sinners. Sa Tagalog, ang sabi, sapagkat kung naging makasalanan ang marami dahil sa pagsuway ng isang tao. Yun nga, dahil nga kay Adam, yung tinatawag na original sin bakit tayo naging marumi lahat so also through one through the one man's obedience the many will be made righteous sa tagalog marami rin ang magpapa ang mapapawalang sala dahil sa pagsunod ng isang tao again it's jesus without jesus obedience eh malabo tayo na maging righteous all right so he's a perfect role model no obviously uh, with all humility, no, ang kanya, para sa kanya, leadership is all about servanthood. Leadership is all about selflessness. No, so kaya uh, napaka dapat dapat tularan natin ang ipinakita ni Jesus sa pagsundod sa kanyang ama. No, imagine niyo yung pinanganak sa hindi ka dumating bilang hari, although ikaw yung hari ng mga hari. 
So sa pagsunod niya, madami ang na-blessed, no? So ganun din kung ikaw susunod sa magulang mo, susunod ka sa boss mo, susunod ka sa teacher mo, susunod ka sa mga church leaders, susunod ka sa mga tao na mga authority na nilagay sa iyo ng Panginoon sa buhay mo, then pagpapalain ka. All right? So tayo po ay manalangin. Hallelujah. Pasisimulan ko po. Magandang gabi po, Panginoong Ama, Tata. Ikaw po ay aming pinupuri ngayong gabi. Uh, we give you all the praises, all the glory, Lord God. We, 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 we acknowledge that you are the King of Kings and Lord of Lords of our lives, Lord. Maraming maraming salamat, Panginoon, sa pagiging Diyos sa buhay namin. We uh, mingi po kami nakapatawaran sa mga nasabi na isip at nagawa namin kasalanan. Naway, Panginoon, linisan mo ang aming uh, uh, aming uh, ang aming mga sarili, Panginoon, sa pamagitan ng banal mong dugo. Dalangin namin ang uh, uh, pagbabago mula sa puso, sa isip at sa gawa, Panginoon. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, ang palubos na pagiging grateful. We are forever grateful to you, God, because you are always there to provide us, to protect, to protect us always. and uh, to nurture our growth, Lord God, in a spiritual journey. Maraming salamat, Panginoon, sa lahat ng pagpapala na binigay mo, patuloy mo binibigay, at ibibigay pa lang, Panginoon. Maraming salamat da- dahil dakila ka sa buhay namin, Panginoon. At uh, sa gabi na ito, uh, isa-isa po kami ang hihingi. Uh, meron po po kami mga pabor na hilingin sa inyo, mga prayer request. Talangin namin, Panginoon, sa aming supplication. Kayo po, Panginoon, ay uh, magbukas ang inyong At tenga, Panginoon, at uh, dinggin nawa ang aming mga panalangin. Tinataas namin, Panginoon, unang-una ang mga Lafilnas, Lafilnas attendees. Panginoon, sa gabi na ito, meron kami bagong kaibigan na nakikinig ngayon, si uh, Sister Lisa, na kaibigan ni Sister Rose, dalangin namin, Panginoon, na ipuin niyo ang puso niya ngayong gabi. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, na pagpalain niyo siya, ingatan niyo po siya palagi. Tinataas sa amin sa panalangin, Panginoon, na siya ay lumago sa kanyang boy spiritual na may matuto po siya, Panginoon, sa pamagitan ng mga bagay. Talangin namin, Panginoon, na isang araw ay makita namin sa simbahan at makasama, Panginoon. Talangin namin, Panginoon, na kung ano man ang uh, dinadala niya sa buhay o um, anumang problema kaya niya kinakaharap, Panginoon, kayo po maging solusyon, Panginoon, sa buhay niya. Panginoon, tinataas sa amin sa inyo ang nam- aming uh, 165th Hanggang 176 uh, church uh, attendees. Uh, tinataas sa aming Panginoon sa inyo si Brother Ruben Santos sa kanyang pagtatrabaho, Panginoon, sa car company. Talangin namin, Panginoon, na siya po ay ingatan nyo. Tinataas sa aming Panginoon sa inyo si Ivan, na apo po ni uh, Tita Fe at uh, anak ni Tita Bing. Uh, ingatan nyo po sa, kanya, sa kanyang work. Pagpalaan nyo po sa, siya, Panginoon. Uh, 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 bigyan niyo po siya ng magandang kinabukasan, Panginoon. Kayo ni Panginoon, si Sister Ada, Panginoon, na uh, sana yung makita po namin muli sa aming simbahan, si Cecilia Jimenea, si Bea Pascual, Panginoon, and si uh, Elijah Ombra, si Raquel Pascual. Uh, dalang na yung Panginoon na kayo po ang uh, mag-ingat sa kanila na why, uh, may... Ma- madala niyo po muli sila, Panginoon, sa aming simbahan at maka- makasama namin sila magpuri sa inyo. Tinataas sa aming Panginoon sa inyo, si Tita Meli, uh, ang mami ni Tita Janet, Panginoon, na dalangin namin na ingatan niyo po siya, magandang pangangatawan at magandang kalusugan, Panginoon. Lagi niyo po siyang pagpalain sa kanyang ginagawa at uh, sa kanyang uh, pinagkakabalahan, Panginoon. Tinataas sa aming ngayon din si uh, Mami Zeni at uh, uh, Daddy Ismael, Panginoon, na uh, Parents sama ni Sister Rose, Panginoon. Maraming salamat sa matagumpay, Panginoon, ng mga surgery, operations. Lahat ng pinalangin namin, pinanalangin namin ay sinagot nyo, Panginoon, sa buhay nila. Dalangin namin, salamat po at nakita po namin sila last Sunday. Dalangin po namin na patuloy po namin sila makita sa simbahan at lumagu po sila sa kanilang buhay spiritual. Dalangin namin, Panginoon, si Odette at si Ogi, Panginoon, Perez, na uh, dalangin po namin na uh, patuloy nyo pong pagalingin si Sister Odette. At uh, patuloy niyo po sila pagpalain, pagpalain lagi at ingatan, Panginoon, bilang pamilya, Panginoon. Maraming salamat, Panginoon, sa kapangyarihan ng panalangin. Tinataas namin, Panginoon, ang uh, LA First Campus, Panginoon. Ang Filipino Church, English, Spanish, at ang dalawang Korean Churches, Panginoon. Uh, sa ating Church of the Nazarene prayer item, uh, would like to request Justin to lead us. Thank you. Lord, we pray for the Church of the Nazarene. Uh, we we pray for 
the general superintendents, Busick, Crocker, Chambo, Sundberg, Daniels, Sarmiento, and the district superintendent, Mark Lehman, and the Lafilnas board, Pastor Jeff, Pastor Bong, uh, Tita Gurley, Tita Rachel, and Tita Elvi, and Lafilnas pastoral staff, Pastor Jeff, Pastor Bert, Pastor Bong, Pastor Rave, and Pastor Kled. We also pray for the English, Josue Tigila, Michael Mata, Dan Bayer, Pedro Torres, and Angela Way. We also pray for the Spanish, Juan Fajardo, Lino Fajardo, and Gladys Rosales, the South Korean, Kai Sun Lee, and Moon Hee Lee. Um, we also pray for the North Korean, Jong Wan Lee, and Hei Suk Lee. Lord, we also pray for the MCB staff, Star Curtis, Nick, and Meaner. Lord, uh, we thank you for these people who serve you faithfully. And Lord, uh, we pray that you would continue to give them wisdom and guidance as they lead your people and as they serve in their, their ministries. And Lord, we also um, pray that you would continue to bless them and their families, uh, whatever provisions that they need, Lord. We pray that you would provide them everything that they need according to your will, Lord. And um, uh, we thank you, Lord, for these people. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Salamat, uh, Justine. For complete healing, provisions, comfort, peace, and other concerns, uh, let's uh, ask Sister Josie to lead us. Thank you. Hallelujah. Patuloy po kami sa diwa ng panalangin, Lord. <clears throat> Lalapit po namin sa iyo na si Jairus, Lord, wag lumaki yung Galvader Polyps. Lord, dalangin po namin, Panginoon, yung pinapanalangin po namin mga prayer request po namin para sa kanya, Lord. At ganun din po yung design ng puso niya, Lord. Nakikita mo po ito, Lord. Dalangin po namin, Panginoon, ipagkaloob mo po ito sa kanya. Ganun din po yung mga pinatest niya para sa kanyang mga chan, Lord. Dalangin po namin na mag-release po lahat, Panginoon, Lord. In Jesus' name, Jesus' name. Ganun din po kay Nathan, Aldrin, at sa lahat ng mga may uh, not feeling well. Uh, ngayon, Araw na ito, ang hindi nung ito, Panginoon. Dalangin po namin, Panginoon, na ikaw po, Panginoon, ang pagaling sa kanila, Panginoon. At uh, lalo na po si Alvin, gagamitin mo po sa Sunday, Lord. Hindi po maging hadlang upang ito ay uh, hindi niya magampanan yung kanyang tungkulin para tayo, Panginoon. Ganun din po si Nathan, Lord. Dalangin po namin na kagaling na naging mula sa iyo, Panginoon. At ang lahat ng may mga... Uh, dinaramdam ng mga sakit, Panginoon, bigyan mo po sila ng kagalingan na gumula sa iyo, Panginoon. Ganun din po, Panginoon, lalapit namin sa iyo si Tita Pepot, Lord, kalonoscopy po niya sa Friday, Lord, ikaw po, Panginoon, nung siyang mamuna sa kanya. Gamitin mo po yung mga nurse at mga doctors, Panginoon, na gagabay sa kanya para maayos po, Panginoon. Ganun din po mga equipment sa gagamitin sa kanya, Lord. Maging maayos po ang lahat, Panginoon, at dalangin po namin at pinasasalamatan mo yung palamang po na magiging uh, maayos po ang lahat ng resulta sa kanyang kolonoscopy, Panginoon. Lord, dalangin din po namin si Claire Sten Steinberg, yung heart problem niya, Lord. Ito po, Panginoon, ang nakaalam nito, Panginoon. Kung ano man po ito, kung lumalaki po or ano po, Panginoon. Dalangin po namin, Panginoon, na ikaw ang Diyos na maalam sa lahat. Alam mo po ang pinagdaraanan niya, Panginoon. Ikaw po, Panginoon, ang Diyos namin, our, our great healer, Lord. Ikaw po, Panginoon, na magbigay ng kagalingan na mula sa iyo, Panginoon. Yun din po si Violi's family, her hereditary health challenges. Lord, hindi na po kami uh, naniniwala sa mga mana-mana, Panginoon, dahil kami po ay nasa iyo na, Panginoon. Pinutol mo na po ito, Panginoon, nung kami nakakilala sa iyo, Panginoon. At alam po namin, Panginoon, na complete healing pang ipagkakalob mo sa kanya, Panginoon. 
Lord, ganun din po kay Ted Garman, complete healing po, Panginoon, ang healing niya, Lord, anuman po yung karamdaman niya, Panginoon, dalangin po namin na ito po hindi lumala at uh, ito po ay makontrol po, Panginoon, sa biyaya at tulong mo, Panginoon. Ganun din po si Linnila Lopez, ay problem, Lord. Dalangin po namin, Panginoon, ibibigyan mo po siya, Panginoon, ng kagalingan sa kanyang mata, Lord. Ikaw nga po yung uh, nagpakita ng kung paano nakakita ang mga bulag, Lord. Wala yung posible sa iyo, Panginoon, Lord. Pagkakalob mo po, Panginoon, ng kagalingan sa kanyang mata, Lord. Ganun din po si Patrick Noel, yung kanak po ni Brother John, Lord, uh, able to walk and join the church. Lord, yung po ang pinakahihiling po namin lahat sa church na makita po namin si Patrick na naglalakad at kasama na po namin, Panginoon, Lord. At alam po namin, Panginoon, na walang imposible sa iyo. Lahat ay posible sa iyo, Panginoon. Magtiwala lamang po kami sa iyo at alam po namin na darating po ang araw na siya po'y makakasama na po namin, Panginoon. Maraming maraming salamat po sa lahat po ng ipinag- uh, pray po namin na ang mga kapatiran namin na ito, Panginoon. Dalangin po namin na matanggap po nila, Panginoon, ang hinihiling po nila. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Maraming salamat, Tita Josie, uh, for complete healing from cancer. Uh, Sister Giselle, thank you. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for tonight, Lord, that we had um, an opportunity to pray for one another. We are lifting up all these people for complete healing from cancer. Um, first, we are praying for Olan, pancreatic cancer, Desoy, ovarian cancer, Marcus Manera, colon cancer, Edna Labyrintho, breast cancer, Ricardo Madrid, lungs cancer, um, Elsa Raimundo, lymph node, Noa de Guzman, um, bone cancer, and we had a dura for complete healing, and Rachel for lungs cancer. Um, Lord, we are so grateful that you are the God who sees, um, the God who loves, brings us peace, and the God who heals. Lord, um, we lift up everyone that these people will be encountering, especially all the medical staff, may use them guide them and give them wisdom that is um, um truly coming from you lord we also claim that their bodies will positively um um just respond to their treatments and all the medicines that they are taking and that um that it will be effective in wiping out the cancer in their bodies lord um truly nothing is impossible with you lord um, may you also lead them to you lord may you help them remember that in your presence, everything is possible. May you always give them strength, um, physically, emotionally, and also spiritually, Lord. Also, we pray that um, you will continue to provide for them and whatever they need, Lord, especially provide for them with all the um, expenses related to their sicknesses, Lord. Um, bless them and sustain them, Lord. We believe that you are the greatest healer. Touch them with your healing hands. Let your healing power over flow through their bodies lord um we are unfailing love you with them in jesus name we pray amen amen thank you giselle for your personal supplication let's ask uh, kuya mani to uh lead us in prayer thank you <clears throat> um for <clears throat> Uh, um, stick lessons renewal that uh, he will pass the panel interview, mga recommendations and approval for ordination. Keep Pastor Jeff, Heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord God, for the victory. We claim victory po. Um, uh, request po na ito for Pastor Jeff. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Jesus. That's um, yung MCB, the Isla Filnas meeting on Saturday. We pray na uh, magiging positive po mag, ang maging effect po nito sa amin po. Yes, Father God, we thank you Lord God po. At saka sa Project 2, uh, continually Lord po yung, yung first Sunday po namin ng Project 2. Uh, it is a victory. It is a success Lord Jesus na we pray Lord for sustainment na masusustain po at sa kami may kataas pa po ang numbers po namin. 
on on the 2 p.m. po ng Sundays. Um, that's a West Nile dinghy. Okay. Yeah, we pray for the West Nile dinghy. Tapos for Gloria, for a good health condition. And then for the new COVID variant, uh, sana hindi po uh, tataas po ulit na uh, hindi na po siya magiging, uh, magiging threat po sa aming uh, buhay po at sa, sa aming pagpupunta ng church. At kay Rose, uh, long hours of duty, we pray for long hours of duty. Saka work sa sustainability, sa sustain po ng work niya. At sa aming mga estudante sa church, sa mga ating mga, aming mga anak for safety in school, sa mga sa mga iba po naming anak na nagda-drive papuntang school, we ask for your covering, we ask for your blood to cover them, for your protection to come upon them. Uh, especially kay Justine, who will be traveling uh, uh, far uh, from home to school uh, for uh, for safety. And wala po mangyayaring accident po. Uh, doon sa nangyari sa Lahaina, sa Maui, Hawaii, sana makarecover na po yung place at sa mga tao po doon. Uh, Makapag-start uh, po ulit sila ng, mapagsimula po sila ng bago po ulit. Okay, Pastor Q, scholarships po, we pray po ng scholarship to come upon her. Uh, Masasustain ma ma po nila yung tuition fee niya sa kanyang pag-aaral. Thank you, Father God, na may plano ka rin po sa buhay po niya. Uh, you're giving this uh, favors for this request po, Lord Jesus. Uh, for the wedding of Dennis and Mao and Shen and Almira. Uh, kay, Lord, kayo po magplano po sa kanila na tutuloy niyo po yung kanilang plans po with your blessings po, Lord. Saka kay Mavi, Sir Mavi, sa kanyang pregnancy, na Lord, uh, Sustain mo po yung kanyang pregnancy na maging healthy po yung baby hanggang sa kanyang lumabas. Thank you, Father God, na magiging additional din na isang magiging Kristiyano paglaki. Thank you, Jesus. And for Joshua, uh, we are praying for his documents na uh, malilegalize, mga ano mga documents na mahanapan mo, and then a place to stay also. Thank you for Lauren, kay Ivan Del Rosario, for Job na makaka-adjust po, si po sila socially, na mabibigyan po sila na, ng, um, ng drive po na makipag-socialize po. Thank you, Father God. Intervene po kayo para po sa, mga, sa kanila po. And for Joshua again, to find uh, work, sana makahanap po siya ng trabaho uh, at kailangan niya talaga magtrabaho. For Sister Jazel, for smooth graduation application, uh, Lord, we pray na sa plan mo po na ma-fulfill po niya sa kanyang pag-aaral, Lord Jesus, na wala sa nang magiging isang gabal uh, sa kanyang pag-a-apply for, for her graduation. And for Marie Pagio, sa so USCI is filing and approval of nurse application. Heavenly Father, we thank you po na ikaw po ang mag-intervene magtutulong po, mag-intervene po sa kanya para sa kanyang approval for the nurse. Uh, NCLEX, probably sa NCLEX examination po niya. Yes, Father God, thank you, Jesus. Uh, sinasabi niyo po na when two or three are gathered, there you are in the midst. So we're praying for this special favors, for this request po, Lord Jesus, that you'll give us a victory. We give us, you give us the light at the end of the tunnel. Yes, Lord, yes, we just want to thank you, Lord God. We just want to give you thanks and glory with our prayers. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen, amen. Thank you, Kuya Mani, for connecting events, evangelism, discipleship, and missions. Sister Janet, kindly lead us. Thank you. Lord, hallelujah. Father, we just come to you tonight, lifting all these connecting events, evangelism, and discipleship, and missions, Lord, for the growth of your kingdom and for the growth of our church here in LA. We pray, Lord, for the oh. ministry fair courtyard, uh, fair courtyard on, uh, on Mar uh, September 17. Lord, we pray that you will 
involve many people, O oh God. Lord, you, we, 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 Lord, as you have said in your word, that pray that the Lord of the harvest will send more laborers in your vineyard. And Lord, we pray that you will touch the hearts of your people to serve, O oh God, and take part of this kingdom building here in in USA. We pray, Lord, for the 39th anniversary celebration. We pray, Lord, for the dedication, dedication day of, uh, of Edric. Lord, we just lift up to you this young boy that you will fill him, Lord, with your spirit, with wisdom. May he be obedient, O oh God, to his, to his parents and uh, to those who are in authority. We pray, Lord, for the board annual planning. We pray, Lord, for the quest Preacher on Sunday, we pray for Pastor that? Sunday Tanieg, Taniegara, Nigra. Lord, that you will give him, Lord, your word, so that your people will be able, oh God, to hear from you through your servant, Pastor Taniegra. And Lord, we pray for the Pastor's Appreciation Day. We pray for all our pastors Wait, that in their local Wait, license, Lord, renewal. We pray for lay pastors, for uh, Pastor Bert. Pastor uh, Cled, and even for Pastor Ray. We lift them up to you, Father. Wow. That you will always continue to fill them, oh God, with your spirit. Wow. Continue to wow. bless them, God. We pray wow. for our Thanksgiving fellowship. We pray for our workers' appreciation day. We pray for the youth, winter youth overnight, youth Christmas wow. party, church wow. Christmas party, wow. and UIA wow. fellowship. Lord, we pray that you will continue, oh God, to provide for all these needs. Continue, oh God, to make availability for all this uh for all these events, oh God, to happen. We just continue to open doors, events for consensus and even divine connections, oh God, all for your glory and to accomplish, oh God, your will for this time and this season for your people, oh God, to flourish in your kingdom. God, we want to thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Sister Janet. Uh, let's now proceed to our popcorn prayer. Uh, other For other supplications, anyone can start to pray. Panginoon, tinataas namin si uh, Sister Bernadette, Panginoon. Uh, dalangin namin, Panginoon, na uh, 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 for God's miracle, Lord God, na uh, mahil ang kanyang uh, uh, EYLEA medicine. Ano, aking yung pangailangan niya, which uh, the doctor said, Panginoon, uh, the best medicine for wet makula degeneration. Uh, this will show up po after my eye evaluation next month. Nalangin ay Panginoon na, na ingatan niyo po siya, patuloy niyo pong pagalingin ang kanyang mata, yung kanyang third consecutive month, Panginoon, ng uh, uh, pag, uh, medication and uh, uh, procedure sa kanyang mata ay uh, maging matagumpay, Panginoon. Nata sa amin sa panalangin, Panginoon, ingatan niyo po at pagalingin niyo po ang mata ni si Sir Bernadette, Bernadette in Jesus' name. Amen. Yeah. Uh, Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Tonight, as we end our prayer, Lord, we ask, well, Lord God, remember those who are uh, affected or those family who are at loss and those who are in uh, Morocco and uh, Libya. Father God, continue as well to comfort them and able to come to know you that you are the Messiah. Even to the Muslim, Lord God, know that you love this as well, these people. Lord, thank you. And tonight, as we retire, Lord God, continue to be with us, your presence. May the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen and amen. Amen. Okay, so, good evening sa inyo lahat. Uh, dali na po ah. Papatayin ko lang yung recording. Yeah. Uh, dali lang po.